So, as I was doing the Magello video, I always check just to make sure there's no uh, sneaky, sneaky uh, modders putting mods out. Um, and one did. Um, <laughs> so, yeah, second comment on the video. You do know the uh, Fred's new uh, mods out, don't you? It's like, uh, literally, literally as I posted the video. So anyway, hmm, here we have the Toyota GT86 Rocket Bunny. But for all you old petrol heads out there, it's a Celica, all right, it's a Celica. Let's not argue about it. So five laps, uh, not driven it, just jumping straight in. All I know is, boy, it looks good. All I know is this is a fictitious race series he's made. Um, the car's rocking about 370 brake horse. Looks beautiful in here. I like the central tyre, that's pretty cool. Uh, I've got the AI on 105. Uh, we're doing Long Beach, which is part of the uh, America's back. Not a muddy track. So these are the kind of track versions of the Celica. And yeah, I am going to call it the Celica all the way through. Sorry. Um, so what can we say about the car? Well, first off, it's very, very responsive. Um, I've picked this bumpy track just to get a feel for the uh, what force feedback's doing and I'm being suitably rattled as you may hear every now and again as my G29 goes bang doing a good job of bouncing off the limiter as well Liveries uh, does a, a metric um, manure load yeah, there is a lot of libraries that's been done for this. Um, and they all look really, really, really solid. Really high res as well. That's a good one. A Cosworth powered Toyota? I think not. Cars are uh, yeah, a bit slow off the mark. They're, uh, yeah, they're good. I was expecting that. I'll return the favour. Really got to keep these up in the high revving range, I think. That's better. Keep them revving. Back end steps out, maybe that's not a great idea. Handle is pretty neutral. Back end's not too uh, objectionable. Yeah, that's the way you got to drive these. Is keep the revs up, or it'll bog down. Going deep. Oh gosh, it's not a happy rocket body over the bumps. I'll tell you that much. I would go as far as saying these are a, a little like a tin top catering. They really do dance around, really sharp handling. These, uh, he's done it again, hasn't he, Fred? He's just, he's just absolutely knocked it out the bloody park. I don't know, sir. I salute you. Five laps of this, but I will be here. Uh, we can be putting a few more laps in after this video. It's just too good. They are. I don't know what you'd race them with. I mean, it's a single race series. There's enough libraries to be happy doing that. To be honest, I'm sure you could put them with something. Dump them in a class somewhere. 
just to put them up against some other stuff. I don't know what, mind you. Suggestions in the uh, comments below. I will put a link to this, of course, in the description below. Yeah, they're making for uh, making th this this kind of power level, this kind of grip. It's making for some uh, really close driving. Can I get the inside? Yes, I can. Oh yeah, you you could happily you could happily do a 20, 30 lap race in these. I won't put you through that, people. Let's see what the tyres are doing. Tyres are spot on. Let's push it. I'll let you have a listen for a lap. Instantly crashes. Here you go. Dump the clutch, get it going again. Take a big chunk of that. Oh, all the way out. I'm looking right, I'm looking at the uh, rev counter. Fastest way of racing is, but well, you know, it is fun. <laughs> He's not a happy body over the bumps. doing one more lap to go right let's 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 try and uh, see what you can do with these things over the bumps. Get on me left. that I will give this a massive thumbs up he's done it again go get these uh, this is your present pre 1.6 release you just go into a bit of information uh, on the website that I'll leave the link to uh, about what's going on with 1.6 and what to expect with the mods but there you go Fred does it again He's a one. He's a one. He's a one-man powerhouse of modding at the moment. That man is. All hail Fred. Adios.